Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. Your girl Brittany here with BB's Crafts. Thanks so much for hanging out. I have a project share for you guys today. This is a swap that was hosted by Craft Purge, our girl Tony, over on Instagram, and this is the Christmas swap. For this, we are going to be in groups of four, I believe it is, right? And um, for this year to make one embellishment but it had to have like five different elements into it so it couldn't just be like you know just a circle with a snowflake on the top of it like you need to really like put in some effort onto that bad boy and then you are to make two bows it could be any style whether it's paper faux leather or tool or anything like that you had to do a sequin mix and it had to have at least either five different colors or five different sizes like five different types of sequins and then also 10 die cuts so i use the mary days collection absolutely love it it was my favorite collection last year i have so much left over um even though i really wanted to jump on the hey santa i was like you know what Brittany, you have a whole bunch of mary days you need to kill that first so um this is how i have them packaged i did the little shrink wrap trick that tony had shared and it was a little hard to do trying to get it like all wrapped up because you know it's a thicker package and technically it wasn't supposed to be this bulky but i'm queen of bulky and i know how to go ahead and get that fit into a padded envelope just saying anyways um so this is how it comes and so they all got shrink rack have a little gift in the back for them and i made this little thing so i just want to show you guys what is on the inside so they're technically like they have like different colors and stuff like that but they're remotely um similar they didn't have to be the same but you know when you do group swaps all the time you know you know how to assembly line it and make it work so i made this little book here and it has a acetate spine this is inspired by bambi deer and i did binder rings and i just wrapped it in this little um ribbon that says Merry Christmas, but it can easily come off. And so actually, I'm just gonna go ahead and cut this off because I do have plenty more to wrap around it. And then, um, so on the front cover, I use this cute little um, like bulb of light and I put that in the background and I have like the little stocking and a little snow globe right here. And then I created this embellishment. This bear was gifted to me by Rosa Vera last year in one of my um challenges i was hosting i made my own little lori flowers i didn't do a huge bulk of them i just you know wanted to give a shot so i did a little lori inspired flower with the little styrofoam ball in the center i have a doily i have a rosette in the back i have this little ribbon bow that was gifted to me by c who sees creations it says season of joy and on the spine i did a little tassel with the bow on top here and um this one is red and white and so i didn't want to put a spine so in case they want to reuse it they can go ahead and put their own closure on there not a spine but i didn't put my own closure on there so in case they want to go ahead and reuse it so they are adhered on to acetate pages the that well acetate the what i made with the sequins and the laminator so here is my embellishment and for this what I did was a scallop circle and then there is a rosette in the center I have a piece of tool here and then I have some chipboard pieces I wrapped chipboard piece I made a shaker and added stitching to the star and then I have a little beaded all the they all say something different this one says Mary and then I also have a dangle hanging and this one has mittens and so that's what she pretty much meant by having different elements um it didn't have to be chunky like this but you know if you wanted to add stitching a dangle you know what wrapping your chipboard you know stuff like that not just something super plain Jane so that is my embellishment and then I shared this on my Instagram, a cute way of gifting sequin mix, but also um, an embellishment in itself. So I did a jumble paper banner paper clip, and this is that tubing that you get from like the Dollar Tree that you would use to add onto your 
uh, handmade wreaths. And so I did that and I made them into bows and I added a snowflake in the center. And then I wrapped my sequin mix around a straw and then added pom pom so it's like a little banner on top of a banner. And then I added this ho 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 sticker from Michael's Merry Christmas piece from the collection and then also did some little bit of decorating with the collection as well and I also stitched close the banner itself so and then there is my sequin mix so it has wreaths bows little Christmas trees it's gold green red black so uh, there's some pink in there so all sorts of fun stuff in that and then for my bows I use my creative time bows and what I did was I did the glitter paper and then I popped it up on dimension and it sits on a pop dot and um, I adhered them together and then this red piece I actually cut in glitter foam adhesive and then I also wire wrapped the center so they can go ahead and add a center to it or leave it as is so that is that and then lastly the die cuts I have it paper clipped here and I added little beads to the paper clip. I did a small little back topper on top of it and I'm not going to really open it up because I don't feel like trying to get it back in there but I just did some trees, I did flowers and then I also did some ornaments for my um, die cuts. So that is what I created. I hope you guys really like what I've made. I hope that my whoever I am partnered or grouped with for the swap enjoys what I created as well. Thanks so much guys and I will see you in the next video. Bye!